Hey guys, so here today I am going to show you a video of my collection. Uh, this will be anime, video game, manga, DVDs, pretty much anything I have. So we're going to start off with my anime shelf. I got the complete first season of Bleach, uh, the first Bleach movie, uh, Fade to, or not Fade to Black, Memories of Nobody, Bleach Fade to Black on Blu-ray, Clannad, the f uh, first season on Blu-ray, Complete series of Claymore on DVD, the Cowboy Bebop movie on Blu-ray, Coyote Ragtime Show on Blue or on a DVD, uh, complete Desert Punk art box set, uh, Digimon the complete first season slash series, uh, the complete season or series of Dojin work, Dragon Ball Z season one, the uh, Blu-ray of Dragon Ball Z 1.1, which is never going to be finished because Funimation likes to be cock teases. The Escaflone movie Ultimate Edition, Blu-ray of es the Blu-ray version of the Escaflone movie, Evangelion 1.11, Evangelion 2.22, Full Metal Alchemist Sacred Star of or Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood Sacred Star of Milos, Full Metal Panic Complete Series Slash Season One. Full Metal Panic from Mofu, uh, and Full Metal Panic the Second Raid, Ghost in the Shell Special Edition movie on DVD, Innocent Venus Complete Art Box Collectors, or Art Box Edition, uh, Inuyasha the First Season, Love Hina the Christmas movie, Mardok Scramble the First OVA movie, uh, Gundam 00 Awakening of the Trailblazer on DVD Blu ray combo pack. First collection of mobile, the original Mobile Suit Gundam and Mobile Suit Gundam F91. We have complete series of Nadesco that was re-released by Right Stuff. Have platinum thin pack of Neon Genesis Evangelion. Complete series of Noin to Your Other Self. Uh, Origin Special Edition Blu-ray. Razafon, a uh, complete collection in the crappy cases that they decide to do. Uh, Roroni Kenshin, Trust and Betrayal on Blu-ray. First two collections of Saber Marionette J. Uh, Sekirei, Pure Engagement box set which also on Blu-ray, which also has my first season of Sekirei in it. Complete first season of Sergeant Frog. The Tenchi Muyo movie collection on Blu-ray DVD combo pack. The third OVA of Tenchi Muyo Ryo Oki. Trigun, the complete collection. And complete series of Yu Yu Hakusho, plus Yu Yu Hakusho, the movie The Poltergeist Report. I also have my second volume, signed by Christopher Sabat. And I also have the second se or second part of Sergeant Frog, signed by Christopher Sabat too, who also did the English voice for Giroro. And then uh, I have some, I have uh, my GNX model, uh, that I got at Animazement a couple years ago. Two little Pokemon figures. Gundam Seed f slash Seed Destiny figures. Uh, forget who... I forget who the name of these two. I forget the name of these two, but uh, these two are the same. I forget their sisters in Destiny. We got Kigali. We have uh, Alto's um, Battle Royd from Cross Frontier. We got some Code Geass figures. Colin... Uh, Lelouch slash Zero, and Suzaku, which also I have my Lelouch figure up there that I got at Otakon this year uh, in his Emperor Lelouch outfit, which is awesome. I love it. Uh, got my Halo Reach Stan Collector's Edition thing, and in front of it has Trunks and Goku, which I don't know if you can see, but their pants are, like, some of the things are, like, gradiented and see-through, uh, which is kind of cool really nice effect. I kind of want to get a light base for him. Uh, Black Ops 1 rover thing. Over here, continuing on uh, figures, I got Gundam Double O figures. I got the first Lock-On Stratos. I got Setsuna, and I have Alleluia, um, along with Sumeragi. I have an Ava figure, kind of doing the berserk thing behind his AT field comes along with a positron rifle and uh, the little thing, uh, the little supply depot thing that's that could pop up around uh, Tokyo 3. Uh, got 
mystery figures, I forget what they're called, but uh, Ghost in the Shell movie tank from the ending. Uh, and then I have a Rin Okamura figure which whose sword's bent, which I really wish I could figure out how to unbend it. That would be good. Uh, for manga, I got the first Force manga volumes of Bleach, the complete doujin work uh, manga. I got the manga and the anime as a set on Crunchyroll. They had a daily deal. Uh, Dorara, season, or, uh, Volume 1. The first three volumes of Full Metal Alchemist. The first two volumes of Gundam Seed Astray. The first volume of G Gundam. All of the Gundam Wing manga, uh, including Battlefield of Pacifist, except Endless Waltz. I do not own Endless Waltz on manga, uh, unfortunately. I want to fix that, though. Uh, first three volumes of Mega Tokyo. Uh, first two volumes of Soul Eater. First volume of Ultimo, uh, Stanley co-created it. It's actually really good. Um, you got soundtracks. I got soundtrack for Evangelion 3.0. I have the Final Fantasy 11 Plus soundtrack, which I think is bootleg. Uh, I'm, cur I'm talking to someone else who has it and hoping to get pictures of theirs. Uh, the Final Fantasy 14 field tracks, which is also, I think, bootleg. I got those at the same place. I won't say where in case it actually isn't. But I have the Skyrim soundtrack, which is signed by the composer. I have the World of Warcraft soundtrack, and I have the Wrath of the Lich King, Fall of the Lich King soundtrack, uh, which includes everything from the ICC raid, which I liked. Uh, moving on to Blu-rays and such, I have Game of Thrones Season 1. Uh, the Girl with the Dragon Tattoo remake uh, that came out last year, if I remember correctly. A piece of cardboard that needs to be thrown on the floor. First seven season or six seasons of Supernatural. First season of Fringe. Uh, Thor, Captain America, Sucker Punch, Inception. The 10-year anniversary set of Red vs. Blue. Halo 4, Forward Unto Dawn. Batman Beyond, Return of the Joker. Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. Stargate, Serenity, Hot Fuzz, uh, Batman Begins in the Dark Knight, along with The Last Samurai and The Hangover. Um, I also have v on DVD, V for Vendetta, Rush Hour 1 and 3, uh, the Cowboy Bebop movie, which also on Blu-ray, the DVD doesn't work anymore because I watched it too much. The Black Hawk Down Deluxe Edition, first two seasons of The Boondocks, The Bourne Trilogy, Shooter, and Mission Hell. Laying around somewhere, I also have the first season of House, the first, I think, two seasons of Burn Notice, the first season of The Mentalist, and I think the first season of CSI New York. Uh, oh, I also have the first Omnibus, or big edition of, or whatever Bandai's big edition thing was, of the, the Eric 7 manga. I have my Renji plushie. Uh, for games, start with my Vita. I have Unit 13, Mortal Kombat, Little Deviants, Dynasty Warriors Next, Blaz Blue Continuum Shift. Uh, for the DS and 3DS, I have Ocarina of Time 3D, Star Fox 64 3D, Tales of the Abyss 3D, Pokemon White, and Pokemon Black 2. Um, I also have the collector's editions of Zone of the Enders, which that's an amazing collector's edition. Get it. Uh, Ragnarok Odyssey for the Vita, Deus Ex Human Revolution on the PC. Uh, behind the Ava is Halo 4 Collector's Edition. Uh, for I have over here kind of a tower of Collector's Editions. The Quadropter from the Collector's Edition of, uh, or the Care Package Edition of Black Ops 2. Modern Warfare 2 Collector's Edition on the 360. I have the Night Vision goggles sitting around somewhere. Collector's Edition of Catherine for a PS3. Collector's Edition of Star Wars The Old Republic. I was very sad when it flopped. Uh, Great premise, great storyline, I mean, great everything except support day. I mean, that, oh god. I've gone back to countless free weekends for it, and it's just their launch issues that were still there, so I'm, uh, I'm kind of through with that. Uh, my Halo Reach CE, Gears of War Collector's Edition box, and my Skyrim Collector's Edition box on the PS3, but I sold that to get the, uh, PC version, uh, because I like mods. I have Record of Agarus War Zero, Collector's Edition. My Ghost Recon Future Soldier, which is signed by some of the developers uh, of Red Storm, who were out on 
the midnight launch for in my area. The Metal Gear Solid 4 limited edition, which is great. And then behind it I have all of my behind these I have all my PS3 games. I have Armored Core 4, uh Blast Blue Collector's Edition missing the slipcase. Bulletstorm Limited Edition, Demon Souls, uh, Enslaved, Odyssey to the West, Final Fantasy XIII, Ico and Shadow of the Colossus uh, HD remakes, Killzone 2, Killzone 3 Collector's Edition, which came with the helmet, uh, Prototype, Star Ocean, The Last Hope International Edition, Rainbow Six Vegas 1, uh, Untold Legends, Dark Kingdom, Vanquish, Warhawk, which was a great game. Uh, White Knight Chronicles 2, which also comes with White Knight Chronicles 1, but I also have White Knight Chronicles 1. I just can't find my case. Uh, Resistance 3, uh, the Uncharted Dual Pack. Uh, here's my Skyrim case. I still kept it for some reason. I don't know why. Then I have my Halo 3 Master Chief helmet. I have Guild Wars 2 Collector's Edition case. Behind that I have my destroyed Alex uh, model kit. That fell on the floor. Uh, for my Wii U, which I got for Christmas, I got Wario's Orochi Hyper 3, Nintendo Land, because I got the deluxe set. And my friend got me Tekken Tag Tournament Wii U Edition, which is great. Uh, there's Ge my Gears of War 3, because I had to buy a new copy. Let me just get all this settled back. For PS2, I got Mobile Suit Gundam Journey to Jaboro, uh, Star Ocean Until the End of Time, Mobile Suit Gundam Federation vs. Xeon, Kingdom Hearts 1, First two uh, volumes of Dot Hack, uh, Ratchet and Clank, uh, Up Your Arsenal, Devil May Cry 2, and the fir and Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty, and Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater, which has a very cheesy theme song. So, then if we come over here, up there is all my PC games, uh, countless ones. I can't really make it over there, but it's basically like Final Fantasy XI, Dishonored, Fallout New Vegas, The Rift Expansion, uh, Rage. Uh, there's my Gears of War 3 statue, and if you want, uh, there's the Guild Wars 2 art frame that I got. I put the Silvari art in it, because I love Silvari. Uh, there's my Wii U box, and there's my Razer keyboard, and my tablet, you know, all that fun stuff. Some posters that I just put up. Sort of Stranger. I got a Hitman Reborn wall scroll that's improperly hung because I don't have any string for it. And if we come over to my desk, you can see I have Darth Malgus sitting next to my, uh, oh, what was his name? Alduin statue, I think. That's his name. Anyway, and I have some magic boxes, there's my unfinished Shinanju that I need to finish, top half of a gun tank, uh, some Madoka stickers that I got from my con as well, some wig heads for wigs that I need to put back on it, my little collector's edition shelf thing, it's got my, uh, got Persona 4 Golden Solid Gold Premium Edition box up there, as along with my Pokemon Soul Silver. let's see if I can zoom in, I can, there's a Gundam Unicorn, a uh, unicorn figure in the unicorn mode, a Gelog, I think it is, from Mobile Suit Gundam, my World of Warcraft beer stein, uh, I have my Dead or Alive 5 Collector's Edition, uh, you can't see it, but behind, you can kind of see the corner of it, that's my uh, Starcraft 2 Collector's Edition, I got my Killzone 3 cloaking marksman figure right there, uh, my Gundam Seed model kit over there, some more Gundam stuff, uh, hockey puck from a team that, uh, I used to watch in hockey back when I lived in Massachusetts, it was a local city team, uh, got the two Pokemon figures for Soul Silver and Heart Gold, uh, and then I got collector's editions of World of Warcraft, uh, Wrath of the Lich King, Cataclysm, Pandaria, the Rift Collector's Edition, the Guild Wars 2 Ritlock statue. There's my Diablo 3 Collector's Edition, a bunch of other things, uh, a bunch of guides. I got um, Skyrim 
Gears of War 2, Modern Warfare 2, uh, Black Ops 1, Modern Warfare 3, StarCraft 2, World of Warcraft, Miss Pandaria, Borderlands 2, Final Fantasy 13, Diablo 3, Legend of Zelda, Skyward Sword, uh, Tom Clancy Ghost Recon, Future Soldier, and Pokemon Black and White Version 2. Or Black and White 2 Collector's Editions. So, uh, that is, yeah, that's pretty much my collection as of now. Uh, and then I have countless games on Steam, of course. Oh, and there's a poster that I won uh, in a Mass Effect contest that I was kind of happy. It's all, it kind of has the same feel as the uh, Skyrim map came in Collector's Edition. So, or I mean in the first edition. So, yeah, that's my collection. Uh, make sure to check my video for the links on how to enter f the contest that I'm having that w where you can grab a DVD or Blu-ray copy. I'm giving away two DVD or, or Blu-ray, uh, your cho winner's choice of Halo 4 Forward Unto Dawn. And one lucky person will get the ultimate edition of Escaflone the movie, which comes with the soundtrack, a bunch of behind-the-scenes stuff, and all that. So yeah, if you uh signing off, I'll see you guys later.